So the short-term uh, opportunities with the Inland Rail project locally have already been evident in the fact that uh, we've, the, the raised heightened excitement amongst local industry and business and also the inquiry from our external business uh, looking at ways that they can be involved in inland rail. It's critical, particularly in these uh, times of uh, COVID, drought, to see a shot in the arm in local, for local industry uh, and watching the excitement coming forward and the forward planning by local industry as well as external. The key long-term benefits for Inland Rail once it's up and running is that it offers a, an extra industry, another opportunity for us to keep quality young people in the bush, stay here, work and contribute, and make a living here. Critically, the country regions, is the retention of our quality young people and the opportunities offered by a, ver by a varying lot of industry, not just agriculture, not just mining, but throwing transport in will offer another wonderful opportunity for us to retain quality young people in the bush and grow. Clearly the opportunity for Inland Rail for this region is allowing us immediate, quick access to markets, whether they be international or national. It allows them, our industry, to value add and be confident in growing their own business, knowing full well that the freight price, the access and the markets are on their doorstep. Transport in infrastructure to a region like Narrabri is critical. When, uh, when we're at a, 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 the distance we have from the coast, the distance we have from the end users, it's absolutely critical for areas like Narrabri to have a high class, efficient, fast transport system that gets us directly into the markets. The Inland Rail will provide that.